Pokemon cards. Indeed, because today we we have a look at all of these little cardboard boxes, which, of course, as you probably know, are filled with Pokemon cards and some other gadgets. But uh, yeah, I went to McDonald's a couple of times, uh, 15 in total. I know that there is also 15 cards, but one pack holds, I believe, how many was it? Four cards, I want to say. So yeah, I am uh, I'm intrigued to see what we are gonna get because I have not opened any of these yet. So uh, here we go. What's exactly inside? We've got this. Let me zoom in. There's a little leaflet. I know it has some kind of game with the cards, um, which also comes with this little spinner thing. Doesn't matter. Um, very cute little pack with Pikachu in front. A match a battle for additional game cards. I have to be careful not to actually rip the pack or the cards inside. The, ripping the pack is fine. The cards inside, not so much. I have no no clue if there is one holo per pack guaranteed like with the cards last year or not. So, Jesus Christ, there we go. But if it is, I reckon it's in the front or the back. So, uh, let's see. First pack. I'm just gonna... Put the front one to the back. I think that might be safer. We start with Ladybar. All right, there we go. Ladybar, the first card. Continuing with Lapras. I know this one is a actual possible hollow. We've got Beware, and then we have. Oh, we start off with a hollow Pikachu right away. That is wonderful. I know that he is uh, the most sought after one, of course, and also the most. Uh, valuable one but of course i still want to uh, complete my collection in these packs i know that there is only 15 with six cards having a hollow alternative okay i i messed that one up we already have a second pikachu which again i will gladly gladly take because he is uh, indeed the most sought after and thus the most valuable one he will always be the mascot after all. So, uh, yeah, another Pikachu. I'll gladly take that. Uh, is it going to be the same pack? Ladybar? Oh, no. Okay. Fluffy, which I really, really love. And then we have Cutie Fly. Look at that. Now, uh, I'm not quite sure how many bo different boxes there are, but I've, I believe I've got five of them. So, um, but yeah. Oh, yeah. Wait, wait, wait. Do it like this. Otherwise, we see the front card again. Now, I, I really do hope that we can complete this set with uh, just the packs that I have. Otherwise, I might have to buy some singles. Because I kind of want to keep one, uh, one of the packs sealed just for the collection. We start off with Eladiba again. Fluffy again. Pangoro, that one is new. And for the Hollow, we have... Gossifleur. Okay, that looks very nice, I have to say. That looks beautiful. Not a big fan of the Pokemon itself, but the card, very, very lovely indeed. Now, you're not able to tell, but I have all the cards here next to me, so I can uh, tell which we still need. So far, we have six non hollows and two hollows. Also, turn it around. Otherwise, again, we will see who we pull as a hollow. So, front one to the back. Turn around. We start with a Tynamo. That one is new. We've got a Drampa, which is also new. Cutie fly and Gossifleur again. Okay, we get two by two. Um, so if this keeps up, I think we will have to open, let's see, how many is it? 12 packs. And then we will have two of each. But uh, again, like I said, I want to keep one pack sealed, although we have 15, because I went to McDonald's quite a few times. But I'm starting to think though, I am starting to wonder, is there... Do the hollows have a non-hollow counterpart? That I am not sure of. So far we have not seen any of them. So we will find out together. We have a Chincha, which has some beautiful artwork there. I really, really like that. Beautiful indeed. Uh, we got a Fluffy again. Okay, we've got a Pangoro again. And for the hollow we have... Smuggle! There we go. There he is indeed. Making a little trail with his tail. Let's open a Growlithe box. Uh, Growlithe always been one of my favorites. Well, Arcanine actually, but you know, pre-evolution, it counts for something, I guess. So uh, let's see if uh, we will be lucky and Growlithe will give us something good, if he has been a good boy or not. Let's find out together. Front to the back, here we go. And we start off with Ladiba again. We've seen him uh, quite some times by now. We have Fluffy. We've got Cutie Fly again, and then we have 
Gossy Flur again. Okay, so it seems like we are having some sort of same water per pack, uh, depending on, on what holo we get. Um, which is something that I see quite often with Pokemon lately, that they're not as randomized as they used to be. Yeah, it's something that I've been noticing, that we, uh, we just keep pulling some cards right after each other in the same order per pack, or per set, I should say. So, uh, it seems to be true here as well. Let's see. We've got a Chinchou. Is it gonna be a Smurgle, I wonder? Chinchou. Lepros, that is a different one, uh, different order. But where? This might be a different, different holo then. We have... No, we do have a Smurgle after all. Okay. So, indeed, two Smurgles, three Gossifleurs, two Pikachu so far. But so far, none of the holos we have pulled, I have seen a... Uh, none of the holos that we have pulled, I have not seen a non holo off. That was a tongue twister there. Also, did I put the holo to the front or to the back? I do not remember. Let's find out. We start off with a Lapras. We have Cutiefly. Okay, I, I, I did. Smurgle and Ladybug again. So, uh, yeah. So far, I've got nine non hollows, three hollows. So, we are indeed missing three cults. And I'm starting to believe that perhaps, indeed, there is only six hollows and the others, older nine, are. Uh, non hollows and I thought that the hollows also had a non hollow alternative version, but apparently that's not true So I must have misinformed myself Browsing the internet so they have the kids don't always believe what people say on the internet Because if I were to tell you right now that I'm actually a pink elephant With a big trunk not all of that is true Anyway continuing we have a ladybug again Lepras again Beware again. Do we get Pikachu? Oh, Rowlet! Rowlet is a hollow as well. Okay, that is beautiful. Lapras, I believe. No, then Lapras isn't a hollow. Okay, so I must have been misinformed after all, yeah. Because I thought Lapras was a hollow as well. So, Victini and Growlithe are the two cards remaining. We have Tynamo, Fluffy, Cutie Fly, and is it Smurgle? Rowlet again. Two by two again. Jesus. It seems like what I said earlier, this one is also a little off center, but uh, it seems like it's gonna be true after all. Okay, we've got three Rowlet, uh, we've got three Growlithe boxes and one Rowlet box, as well as uh, a Pikachu box left. Let's open the Growlithe packs or boxes and hopefully pull the little boy. That would be fantastic. And then, of course, Victini. This one is already quite off center. I can tell from the back. It's Ladiba again, Drumpa. That is a different order. That might be a good omen. Trampa, Cutie Fly, and... Yes! Yeah! Growlithe indeed. Wonderful. Yeah, this one is a little off center, but still, what a beautiful card. It usually is so that they are already existent, and then they just make a, uh, a promo version of it by making it hollow, which was true, for instance, with last year's uh, McDonald's set as well. But um, again, I could be mistaken, I have not been keeping up with the newer sets that much as I, of course, mainly collect the old Wizards of the Coast cards. Anyway, we have another Chinchou, another Lapras, and a Pangoro, and then, is it Victini? Ah, it's a Rowlet again, okay, I'll, I'll take that, I'll take that. Um, seeing as we've pulled Rowlet a couple of times and I only have run Rowlet box, Let's open it up, shall we? Let's see what we have in this one. If indeed, Rowlet will be making us the happy boy. I hope we can pull it and we can completely set again. Quite off center on the back, I can tell, but that's fine. That would only matter if we're grading it. We have a Tynamo. Fluffy. Cutify this order we have seen before, so we, I think we might have a Smurgle. We have a Gossifleur. That's the fourth one. We have two packs left. Uh, I kind of want to keep one sealed, I have to be honest. I kind of want to keep one of them sealed. Just for the sake of collecting. But I have faith. I have faith that the Growlet box will give us the card that we need. The Victini. So let's find out. Ladiba, okay. Oh, Drampa. That might be a different... Beware, I think it's going to be a Growlithe again. Yes! Oh, okay, that was a close one. That was a close one. Alrighty, there we go. Victini. 
So there we go, 5 out of 15. So um, I guess that the set indeed is complete. Uh, I kind of wish that Gossifleur, for instance, would have been replaced with a Lapras. Um, would have been cooler to have Lapras as a holo, or perhaps Victini as well by, I don't know, Pangoro. So we would have different types as hollows because now we've got two electrics and two cross types. Uh, but still, you know, I'll, I'll gladly take it. It's nice to have the set complete. It's been a long time. Uh, and yeah, 15 cards after all and not six non-hollows and hollows and then a nine uh, regulars. No, it's just 15 in total. So uh, I was definitely misinformed here. Again, don't read everything that you read on the internet, and not everything is true. Anyway, I hope that you did enjoy it nonetheless. If you did, please let me know by leaving a like, leaving a uh, little subscription. That's what I meant. Yeah, that's not what I meant to say in that order, but doesn't matter. And we will see each other in a next video. Take care, everybody. Bye-bye.